Hey Pokemon fans, Epilepsy here, and for question of the day, what's your favorite tier to play in? Because I am now playing in OU, and I don't usually do OU, I usually have UU and under, but I'm going OU now, and Mandibuzz is one of my favorite Pokemon to be in OU because it's bulky, it's got the fog, it can do anything. This, this bird is amazing. So I'm going to go for a foul play, and uh, he started with the... Was it thunderous? And he did a hard switch, so I went for a foul play and actually hit this uh, Heatran. And Heatran's gonna go for an overheat this turn, and that is not good for me, not at all. So you already know I was gonna go for default because I thought he was going to set up Stealth Rocks because I do know Heatran does have access to Stealth Rocks. Did not, so uh, I'm kind of in a predicament. But I can survive another overheat because he lowered his special attack, the first one, and I'm gonna roost. I'm, <laughs> I gotta survive. I got to. Um, it's Mana Buzz is so good. It, it's probably one of the better uh, Pokemon. So, but yeah, um, Heatran is a problem. But he's gonna do a hard switch. It's going to send out Heracross, which is not really a problem, except that it gets access to Rock Blast. And Rock Blast is a very bad thing. But I had a feeling he was going to switch, so I wanted to get the, uh, what's it call it, a Toxic on one of his Pokemon. I didn't know it was going to be Heracross, but I wanted it to be, uh, I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking that it could have been, but, um... So, I'm going to go to Garboder to eat up any physical attacks that this thing has. Um, and he's going to go use the Rock Blast, which uh, I kind of knew was going to happen. But Garboder is just kind of eating that up. And since he didn't go Mega, he doesn't have Skill Link. So, uh, yeah, maybe it is not a Mega Heracross? Maybe, maybe not? I don't know. It's kind of a too early to tell kind of thing. But uh, he's going to send out Heatran again and he trying can kind of take down garboder but i'm just gonna set up spikes i it it's gonna be good it can really hurt heatran when heatran keeps coming in but uh he's gonna go for earth power and that's going to deal massive damage to my garboder um not be able to ko because i am pretty bulky and i'm gonna go for pain split and get a lot of hp back well not a lot but i'm gonna do some damage to heatran i would say I did probably more to Heatran than I got back, because Garboder is uh, pretty crazy. But he's going to go for another Earth Power. Oh, Garboder, why do I lose you so much? Oh, okay, I'm going to go right into Galvantula. I'm, I'm seeing that this is more of a, like a full-on attacking Heatran, so I'm just going to send out my Galvantula. Go for the Sticky Web. And he's going to go into his Latios, and it's shiny, and it's going to have Defog. So, oh gosh, I, I, I kind of want to have Spikes, and I want to have my Sticky Web on the field. But I'm going to go for a Bug Buzz. I'm going to try to do uh, something to this thing. But uh, not able to get a KO. No, no KOs for me. <laughs> That's okay, that's okay. Um, now he's gonna do a hard switch into Thunderous, and that's actually really good for me because I kind of went for a good attack, but, uh, it's not gonna do anything to this Thunderous. Like, it does a lot, a lot more than I expected, but, uh, he's gonna go for that, uh, Thunderbolt, not be able to take enough damage. He does show me that he's Life Orb, so, uh, I'm gonna go for a Thunder, and I'm gonna deal a lot of damage to this thing, because, well, Galvantula is awesome. Um, he's going to do a hard switch, though, um, because he doesn't want to lose his Thunderous right now. And he's going to send out Tyranitar, and Tyranitar is not a good Pokemon for Galvantula to be going against. Though I do get the, uh, super effective with Bug Buzz, um, it's just not, 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 not something I need. But he's going to, uh, pretty much just eat that up, though. Look, Bug Buzz is going to do jack to this thing. Um, he's going to go for the Crunch. That is going to take down my Galvantula. Galvantula is not, like, bulky at all. Um, but, yeah. 
Galvantula is dead. So now I'm gonna send out my Mawile. Because Mawile is a beast! I love her. I love her so much. I love Mawile. I really do. It's it's Lady Glue. She's she's amazing. Predicted I was gonna go for the Sucker Punch. Maybe. Or maybe the Iron Head. I don't know what Marcellus was predicting. But he was predicting something, and I don't I just don't know. But uh yeah, I go for the uh, nice and powerful Iron Head. Get that nice and powerful KO. Now he's gonna go out to Heatran, and Heatran is well something that's really bad for Mawile to be going against. But I have Sucker Punch, and Sucker Punch is amazing because priority, and it actually does a decent amount of damage and takes down Heatran. Good job. Now he's gonna send out Latias, and that is another Pokemon that's gonna be very bad for uh, Mawile. Predicted I was going to go for Sucker Punch. I predicted that you were going to defog and survive the Sucker Punch. So I went right for the play rough. That's another attack that goes super effective on dragons. So I got that right there. <laughs> now, the Sandstorm subsides, so that doesn't really affect me, but now he's going to send out Heracross. Now, this is Mega Heracross. Oh my lord. This is going to be fun. This is going to be real fun. It's going to go for the Earthquake. That is going to deal massive damage to me. Because that's super effective. But I survive. And I go for a play rough. And I take this thing down. Oh my goodness, Moile. You are a monster. She is the entity of monster. I'm going to send out Azumarill. And, well, I kind of knew that he was going to Aqua Jet. But... What, what can I do? There's not really anything that wanted to risk having this thing belly drum on me. So I'm going to send out Swagnamite. Or Swagnazone. A.K.A. Magnazone. Which is Magnetite. <laughs> uh, so he's going to go to T-Tar. And uh, T-Tar is going to get the Sandstream. And going to be bulky as everything. And that's not nice. But... Maybe I can get uh, another crit like I just did. Who cares? I got a flash cannon. That does a lot of damage. And he's going to go for Earthquake. Doesn't affect me. I have the air balloon. He didn't see that I had the air balloon. So that's very good. So I'm going to go for another one. Um, he's going to Fire Blast. And I was like, okay, so this is a mixed attacking T-Tar with Fire Blast. But I kind of took that quite well, even though I got a burn. And uh, my air balloon popped. So um, I was kind of scared. Um, so I went for a Thunderbolt. I, I don't know why. I've been mispredicting everything. Like, I thought it maybe a switch into Azumarill or something. I don't know. I don't know what's going in my mind. But it's going to take me down with a Crunch because, well, it is neutral now, unlike what it was last, uh, last generation. And now I'm going to send out my Sinchino. I'm going to go for the Bolt Seed and, uh, easily KO this Tyranitar at this range. Um, get a crit. Crit did not matter. I don't care what anyone else says, crit did not matter. He's going to send out his uh, Azumarill, and the Samsor is going to subside, and you already know what's going to happen. I'm choice banded into uh, Bullet Seed, so it's going to be a win. So please, guys, hit me with a try attack, like, comment, and subscribe, and come on. It, uh, don't forget to question the deck. What's your favorite tier to play in? And until next time, later.